The Ketchum Indians have had it tough over the past few seasons, winning just four games in the past two years. But with a three-year starter back at quarterback and a bona fide D1 receiver, the Indians have the potential to put up the kind of numbers this year that they haven't seen since Ketchum won the league title five years ago. I think that this year we're um, especially more athletic than we were last year. Timmy Cipollini's returning for his third year. It helps have a you know an experienced kid back there. It certainly helps. Jair Stevens returns with plenty of interest from D1 schools, including West Point and Buffalo. We've got a little more uh, variety in terms of players that we can get the football to. I think we've got to have a little more speed on the field this year. You know, we lost four of our five uh, starting linemen, but you know through the course of the year we did have two or three uh, juniors who got considerable playing time. So um, it's not a totally inexperienced group. This is secret to the trade room, so it are Let's talk about your coaching staff, who you have coming back, and who's new. Uh, I, we have uh, Mike Bianco returning as our defensive coordinator. Uh, John Devine is working with our secondary. He's been with us for a long time. Um, John Sullivan, coach of the linebackers, he's been with us now for three years. Um, brought on uh, Seth Lamondo, the graduate, Ketchum graduate, is helping us out this year as well. Most people know Seth from baseball, but uh, here he is at football. What does he bring? Uh, Seth is an excellent teacher. He's obviously was a, a college competitor. He played high school football for us. So it was kind of a unique combo of uh, quarterback, defensive end. He's just a tough kid. He's a competitor and he's a great teacher. So um, we're happy to have him on board. This year's league includes the usual suspects, but adds these Rockland teams into the mix. Our first goal is to make the playoffs. All right, every year we want to be a playoff team year in and year out. Um, so obviously we need to prove, improve on the three and six record. Um, from there we want to be league champs. And once we qualify for the tournament, then you know obviously once you're in a tournament, the goal is to win it. Ketchum opens up at home on August 31st with a league game against North Rockland.